first intro in the new house. We bought a new house! We Yay! bought a new house! <laughs> and we are filming in this empty bedroom because all of the other rooms in this house are very echoey. Echo! Poopy poopy! Poopy poopy! Echo! Also, look at our heckin' garage. And the only logical way to stop this echo is to fill it with stuff. Luckily, we happen to have a house bursting at the seams with stuff back in Houston. So let's go get that. Woo! <laughs> Smooth. Recording Andrew, we look so cute. <laughs> so we're back home. Oh, current home. And uh, I just wanted to share a little bit of how we're getting organized with all the things that need to be done. Caitlin put together this amazing list broken down by how many weeks before the move, all the things that we need to do. And Caitlin deserves all of the credit for this because I would have forgotten everything. <laughs> now, obviously this is a lot to do and I'm overwhelmed. So I'm going to focus on what always helps me feel more on top of things getting organized, specifically with what stuff the movers won't be moving and how we're gonna keep track of all the stuff they will be moving. The, the current task that I'm about to start is we have a lot of stuff that the movers are not gonna move for us for various reasons. Some things are, are against policy. They can't move open containers of resin. What? I know. Or <laughs> welding tanks. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I know! <laughs> Some things are technology stuff that we'll want to pack ourselves. Yes, yeah. all these very specialty things. <laughs> There's some stuff that we're going to leave with the house or give away. You know, just a few things, just a few decisions to make. Well, at least you have a comfort job. I do. She doesn't want me to get up and start packing. Yeah, she's like helping and hurting at the same time. I know, but look at her. I, I can't, I don't even know what I'm looking at. It's just a... Um, hello? <laughs> She's like, hello, you disturbed my scratches? Oh, okay, yeah, more this scratches. Is back to scratches. Our house is looking crazy. We have like, <laughs> you know, we're not using our kitchen for cooking anymore. It's just oh, no. horizontal surfaces used for organizing and staging. Yeah. Yep. Kaylin especially is like feeling the anxiety and anxiousness of like not being ready. So yeah. <laughs> we're, we're Evan going. keeps reminding me like, as long as we back up our data, prep the things for Jube, that's all we technically need to do. And I'm like, yeah, but this, like, all these other things, like, they're not technically needed to be done, but it would be so much more efficient. We need to group now. all of our exercise things together. Yeah. And we need to like. So they know to put them together. <laughs> things that like we want to leave for the previous owner like paint colors and I, I labeled them all for like where they go you know there's just like there's a lot hey there stressed out caitlin you know what would make you less stressed even more labels between this house and the new house there's not really one-to-one -one corresponding rooms mostly because we use the rooms in this house and we'll be using the rooms in the next house for things that aren't really intuitive or expected. For example, in this house, our guest room is also a 3D printer room and our treadmills are in the breakfast nook. So the room labels are really important because we can't expect anyone else to guess where this stuff is supposed to go. And to make things better, we are also color coordinating everything. Now that we're organized, it's time to remove our DIY projects from the house. Imagine if we just left this, <laughs> left it for you the mean, future owners. How no. are we robbing them? We can't, we can't leave this behind. Yeah, I know. It's one of my most prized <laughs> possessions. We're taking it. <laughs> we also had to completely disassemble our two desks and green screen frame because we built them all in the room and they couldn't physically fit out through the door. I know. What are the women's doing? I like how the beard made it into the technology box and the googly eye glasses. <laughs> After hours of disassembling furniture inside, we headed to the garage for more. I watched our garage renovation video to see how we put this up and we just clapped. Maybe that'll work to get it down. Oh, the other one didn't work. Guess we have to take that one down manually. Whoa! Still got it. <laughs> We continued this process during a live stream and set our eyes on our eyes. Ready? Okay, whoa, wait, 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 I didn't say I was ready. Okay, I'm ready. Oh God. Why did, oh, uh-oh. Is that, oh, that's the back of the eyeball, not we didn't peel something off we of that. We hot glued them on. <gasps> oh, we hot, that's hot glue. 
Uh, oh. Ah. You yeah. can still see the shadow of his eyes. It like looks a like corpse. a zombie. People are having lots of suggestions. Alcohol, Ugh. water on a sponge. Alcohol. We're testing life hacks here, guys. Life hacks live. I'm applying alcohol. Ready? Whoa! Whoa! The life hack actually worked! Whoa! They forget they used the alcohol trick in a video before. Do we do that? One additional trick that you guys left for us, you can release hot glue with alcohol. <laughs> Forgetful Evan and Kaylin, it's... It's a thing. Now we gotta take these with us to the new place. Yeah, they're part of our brand. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> you know, because you just moved your mouth, I can make you say anything there. You didn't actually say any words. Blah, blah, wah, 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 wah. I agree. But, 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 yum, yum, wow, yum, yum. Wow, so talking about <laughs> We had to say goodbye to the Toast Coasters because they were infested with bugs. End of an era! And we disassembled the CNC table because we want to build a new one at the new shop. We also detached the treadmill desks, the art ledge, our coat rack, and so many other DIY projects until finally there was only one left. We've detached everything we can from the house and there's only one thing left, and that's the catio. And we've been holding off because Juby really, really likes it. She uses it every single day. And I know that when we told you guys that we were moving, your main concern was- the catio. <laughs> for the catio. <laughs> so the plan right now is we're gonna detach it. We're gonna take it. I don't know if it will fit in any, you know, like through any of the windows, if it's at the right level for the new house, we're gonna take it just in case. The plan is ultimately to build a new one, but for now, we are gonna detach it, so Juby's gonna be sad. Don't worry, Juby. You'll have a new house to explore soon. I'm not sure if she'll like that or not, but. <laughs> no, too late. No. Oh, no, oh, oh, no, no, oh no. no, oh no, oh no. Do we need to lock it? Oh no. <laughs> Just go ahead and remove it so she doesn't head rub it and not trust it anymore. Juby, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, my heart. <laughs> here, you can hang out in here. It's the new carrier we bought you. Yeah, no. You, you don't know as a carrier yet. <laughs> yes. yes. Here, you go hang out there. It's, it's great. It's, it's a great. great place to be. So li lift up on the top first. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> oh no, oh Juby, oh no. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, Jovi, it's okay. Oh, Jovi, oh, oh no, she no. She really wants out. Here, 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 I have an idea. Yeah. Oh no, she's gonna do it again. Jubi. Here, Jovi, come here, come here. Yeah. Hang yeah. out there. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Poor baby. Oh, she doesn't like this. She's so confused. It's just a tough spring. Okay. I know. Oh. She's like, how do I get to the catio from here? <laughs> Thank you for your valuable contribution to Jube's happiness, catio. Oh. oh, oh, weird. I'm sad. I'm worried about Jube. So when we installed the catio, we cut a hole for the supervisor to get out of, and we knew that future us would pay the price for that. But yep. future us is us now. So we got to fix it. This is gross! Gross! Oh, it's so gross! <laughs> Reminds me of those like candy string. It's kind of stretchy. Yeah. Yet it's disgusting too. Mm. Alright, now this should just pop. This is probably glued together with bug guts. Ah. Yeah. Ugh. It is okay. We learn in every day. Hey, we're learning here how to do the things you want to do. <laughs> oh. All right, baby. Already. He gotta screw it in. <laughs> well, it's about 11, oh, is that right? 11.30? Oh no. 
11.30 the day before our movers get here. The past few days have been insane and our house looks completely different. <laughs> let's just, let's, let's give you a little tour. A little house tour. A little pre-move house tour. Okay, so everything in the attic, all of our storage got broken down. Here's the CNC table. We honestly still have a lot of work to do in here because we need to remove shelving and pegboards, but laundry room looks the same. Here is our staging area of stuff we don't want the movers to pack, which has grown a lot since you saw it earlier in the video. I don't think we can fit all the stuff we wanted to fit in our car. We'll deal with that later. Kitchen's pretty normal looking. For some reason, we have a lot of light bulbs and they all ended up here. <laughs> We have our mobile streaming setup, our treadmill desk. <laughs> the junk room doesn't look too much worse. You know, the junk room looks kind of better. <laughs> oh, the oh, office, this, oh, this, this is gonna be the weirdest room. Yeah. What happened to the desks? There they are. Here's and one. Over here. <laughs> These wouldn't fit through the door. We actually built them in the room and this is the only way to get them out. In our room, we're trying to pack some stuff for us for the next couple of weeks. Oh, hey, Dubai. Hi, Dubai. Dubai is helping. We're gonna use Evan's closet as the jube room when the movers are here because that's like the place she by default goes to when someone comes to a house and is working on it. So it seemed like that would be the place she's most comfortable when she wants to hide. I'm not sure if I can say that I'm feeling ready for the movers to get here, but I feel proud of what we've done over the last few days. I'm proud, but I'm 100% I'm not ready. And I, know, I have no idea how tomorrow's gonna go. Like we've said, we've never used packers. It's very intimidating. We're gonna try to film some stuff. I don't know how much we're gonna know. film. We'll Anyways. find out tomorrow and we'll see you then. Bye. We went to bed at around three and it's now 6 a.m. Doobie, did you get enough sleep? I wanted her to have enough time for breakfast and some morning hangouts before we put her in her <laughs> designated room. Oh. We have a little bit more prep to do too. Yeah. Then the Packers arrived and it was a whirlwind. <laughs> 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 That's a big truck. We were able to help in some areas like the garage, but we were also so tired that for parts of the day, we just sat in our designated no pack zone corner, trying to stay out of the way. Hi, right, Caitlin. How are you feeling now that the movers are here? I'm feeling calm enough to make a very quick cup of coffee. <laughs> I'm feeling better. Progress. Fueled by coffee and sugary cereal, we were able to run around the house a few times and capture the progress. before inevitably crashing into a nap. You guys wanna see what it looks like after day one of packing? <laughs> it looks great. <laughs> I'm so glad we yeah. hired professionals. I can't believe how much progress has been made in one day. This is insane. This, this alone would have taken us like a week. <laughs> yeah. But here, well, we have a very important guest to release from her. <laughs> from her closet, closet. prison. <laughs> Julie, we're sorry. She's in her Heidi box. Oh, Hi. Oh. What do you want to go explore, Juby? Look at all these boxes. Hey, baby. Hey, hey. You're okay, huh? What is this? Oh, did we bring that box? <laughs> that oh, box yeah. has been blessed. Yeah. The bath items box. Do you it's like okay. this much cardboard or do you not like it? I think she's kind of having fun. <laughs> is she gonna oh, go no. run on the cat wheel? Hey, we've been evicted from this dimension. Something about noise violations. That's strange. I always listen to my space jams on my Raycon Everyday E25 earbuds, the sponsor of today's video. I, I wonder what the noise violation came from. No, no, oh, space nuts. I'm singing in the void of space. I brought refreshments, huh? I, I can't really think of anything. Well, at least we'll have our Raycons to listen to music, podcasts, and audiobooks on our interdimensional trip. Yes, and they have six hours of playtime. That'll last at least 2% of our journey. And we'll be comfortable too because Raycon offers their wireless earbuds with a variety of fit options and a 45 day free return policy just in case. And they come in a range of fun colors and patterns so we won't mix ours up. Don't want to cause any fights over whose earbuds are whose during our long trip together, huh? Yes, I'm sure there's nothing else we could possibly fight about. <laughs> 
Anyways, what are you waiting for? If you want seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and a more compact design, Raycon has you covered. All at about half the price of other premium wireless earbud brands while sounding just as amazing as other top audio brands. So click the link in the description or go to buyraycon.com slash Evan and Kaylin to get 15% off your order. That's buyraycon.com slash Evan and Kaylin. Boop. So we actually just found out that tonight is our last night in the house. We thought we had two more nights and that we would be driving up in the morning, day after tomorrow, but no, we're driving up tomorrow night. Yeah, that means that like tonight is the last night in this house ever. Are you sad? What are your feelings? Um, it's a little weird because it's unexpected. Not that one day makes that big of a difference, but I'm not as sad as I thought I would, excuse me. <laughs> I'm not as sad as I feared I might be. And I think the reason is because we have documented so much of our memories in this house. So it doesn't feel like we're losing something because all those memories and all those videos are still gonna be here. I'm, I'm gonna hold off my final judgment until like we are actually like walking out of the house and we're driving. I think yeah. that's when it might start hitting me. But also it's like, I'll be super excited. It is a strange mix yeah. of emotions because it is it is kind of sad, but. <laughs> Ruby's just actually been pretty excited. She's, she's just like, been liking exploring, <laughs> look at her. She's like full adventure mode. She's like, I need to explore every little thing and see what's changed. <laughs> Toe Juby, just wait. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. It's so weird to see the cat wheel packed because it's like <laughs> such a funny shape. Day two was loading the truck day, but also disassembling the garage day, which was an all hands on deck project. I forgot to empty the dust collector, so we're moving our dust too. <laughs> All right, mid moving day number two. Oh wait, oh. No. Adjust, oh. adjust. Adjust, adjust. The best thing about today, guys. It was supposed to rain. Don't jinx it yet. It's still early. It's great. Want to see inside the, 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 the truck? I would love to. Look at you have out there. This is crazy. It's so efficient. Yeah. That's like half of our house. <laughs> and just a small portion of the truck. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> As the furniture emptied out of our house, the movers were nice enough to make us a temporary desk to work at. <laughs> and then finally, there was nothing left. Ready for our updated house tour? <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> it's empty! It's probably really terrible audio. Hello! So here's the empty dining room. Wow. It's weird. Kitchen kind of looks the same, honestly. Yeah. Garage. Oh my gosh, yeah. This is where we stand. Hey guys, we're Evan and Caitlin. Ah! It barely feels like it's our house anymore. Yeah. Which is like, I'm not really sad at this moment still. I'm still more excited. I keep waiting for the sad to hit me and it's not that I don't, oh, it's so echoey in here. Oh. Oh. It's not that I am not feeling emotions about this house. Like there's definitely nostalgia and it is weird, but I have, I don't know, just so much excitement for the next one that it's like overpowering anything yeah. negative. Yeah. The shame room. Oh, it's no longer a shame room. Yeah. Like look how tiny, this is the office. This is, this is where we lived. This is where we lived in this tiny little room. Our room. Yeah. Also weird. Juby? Can you forgive us? Hi. Is this so weird? Please don't get dusty immediately. There's so much dust. Oh, she's going exploring. She's searching for the dust. Is it so weird? Hi, <laughs> are you coming back? It's okay, baby. What'd you think, Juby? Oh, she looks so tiny. I know. She's like, I'm going back to my closet. <laughs> Okay, well, we gotta load the car and then we gotta load this one in the car. Wish us luck.
We're in the car. Jube <laughs> is here. You can't see her very well. She's doing pretty good. She she is fine when we're going at the same speed or accelerating. She just doesn't want us to decelerate. Yeah, she she meows when we brake, but other than that, she's actually been surprisingly okay. I think I'm kind of in disbelief that like we're actually on the drive to the new house. We're doing it. We are hours away from our new house. That's what's important. Hours away. Okay, baby. Are you ready? It's time to check out the new house. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, did you almost drop the camera? <laughs> no. <laughs> hey, Joe Bay. Yes. Aw, baby girl. Yeah. Are you ready? Hi. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's okay if you want to stay in here. Do you want to be in a smaller room? We could go to the closet. <laughs> She's just looking out the side <laughs> window. Do you want to go outside this way? Oh, oh, she popped. Oh, she popped. Oh, there she goes. Here, do you want to get her um, her blankets and stuff? Yeah, I'll be back in a second. We built her a little tent. Are you just a little void? Yeah. After we got Juby settled, we went to go check on our garage floors. We got them epoxied before we moved in because we knew once we moved in, we'd never do it. There's just too much stuff in our garage. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so nice. We can't walk on it yet. Like holy ground. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we cannot step. Is, the, is this the biggest resin surface we've ever owned? It is. <laughs> Hi, Juba. We're back to where this video started. <laughs> Laying down on the carpet. We don't have any of our stuff yet. The echo is still not gone. Ugh. But we are back here. And I'm excited. And I'm tired. <laughs> yeah. At least my parents gave us an air mattress to borrow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope it doesn't deflate. My mom was like, it's been in the garage a while. I, I, it didn't deflate last time we used it, but I don't know. It's fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> okay. Good night. See you tomorrow for move-in day. Oh, Julie is blessing the batter. Oh, Jubei, what do you think about that? Please don't use your claws. Please don't use your claws. Moving day! Yay! We didn't check in in the morning because the movers got here early and it was kind of immediately yeah, go, go So we're already partway through move day, mm -hmm. but everything's going smoothly except for the epoxy floors. Yeah. yeah, no, it was super humid. They're supposed to be done in time before we moved in, but because of the humidity, they didn't quite cure. Yeah. And, and we know epoxy. We know when epoxy is cured. We could dent it with our fingernail. So moving everything in right now would, would have led bad. to like permanent scarring of our brand new epoxy floor. And the reason why we, we had it done before we moved here is because there's no way that we would really like do it with everything already in there. There's too much stuff in our garage. Even seeing it in the driveway, I'm like, how did that even fit in the old garage? Yeah, I don't know, I don't know. So yeah, I, I quickly ran out and got some protective boards to cover it. Yeah. And I think that that hopefully that hopefully will protect them. Hopefully that's the biggest snag. Yeah. And it's smooth sailing. We here. won't find out for another week or so when we remove them. Oh yeah. Anyways, <laughs> let's just enjoy move-in day. Let's just get back to think it. Think about that later. <laughs> <laughs> ah, starting with a grunt. Ending with a grunt. <laughs> we took some time off from filming, christened the, the new house with family and a lot of noise and hanging out. And now it now it feels like home. Now it feels and that's, like home. That's really that's really <laughs> I know it's kind of like... a big <clears throat> jump from like the chaos of earlier yeah. till now, but it's what we, we needed. I'm I'm glad we did it. I think that like now I'm emotional, but not because we're, we left the old house, but because like now this feels like, like Aww. home. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I, I'm, I'm happy, yeah. Me too, baby. But don't wanna get too emotional yet because who knows if it's even an approved house. We yeah. haven't 
gotten supervisor approval. We've kept her in just the guest room mm -hmm. of the house because we didn't want to overwhelm her with movers or tons of loud family. But if she doesn't approve of the house, we got to return it. Oh, we got to return it. Uh oh. Are you in the closet still? Hi, Juby. Are you having a good time in your fort? Is cozy. <laughs> yeah? Oh, yes. You want to Do you want to explore? Are you bread? Everyone's gone. It's just you. It's just your house now. Look. Yeah. It's a whole white house. Well, she approves of this room. <laughs> yeah, she really likes this one. Oh, she just yawned. Oh, stretch. Oh, oh look at that. Look yeah. at that tall tail, the little stretchy. Yeah. Oh, oh she oh, going. Oh, oh, she going. She oh, she going. Yeah, this is our house now. Oh my gosh, wait till you see the couch. Hi. <laughs> she had butted the bench hole. You found your ham wheel. I get the feeling that she's like slightly confused yet also excited. Yeah. Well, do you like it or do we have to return it? I keep it. Jube, come join us. She's too busy exploring. She's having <laughs> she's, a real good time. She, she's building her mini map of the new house in her head. Like so you. Cute. Yeah. <laughs> well, honestly, we were a little worried about how she'd take the new surroundings, but she's noticing the things that she's familiar with. And mm -hmm. I can tell that she's like getting really excited about like exploring. She's like, what's up here? What's over there? Yeah. She's in a good mood. But I think with that approval, that brings us to the end of this video. We're not gonna do a big house tour for privacy reasons, but you will be seeing various rooms in this house as we take on projects in them. Yeah. yeah. So and thanks for joining us on this crazy journey. I know, <laughs> yeah. time for us to go sleep. <laughs> and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye. Boop.